The chaos in Ukraine has real financial consequences, whether it's crypto, stocks, food and fuel prices, and much more. Here's what's going on. Russia invaded Ukraine and is waging an unimaginable war on innocent people. Most of the world agreed to basically defund Russia or take their economy out of the global financial system to punish them. Russia is, of course, the largest country in the world, but its economy isn't very influential on the global stage. Russia's one meaningful contribution is oil. Russia's oil powers the global economy. The Russian sanctions mean that the price of oil is going up and up, and that's causing worries in the financial markets. Oil prices influence all other parts of the economy. Think about it. We have to move things, power factories, and make things like plastics. That involves lots and lots of oil. And until we have alternatives that are greener, we're extremely addicted to oil and dependent on not-so-nice countries like Russia to make it cheap and widely available. So if you're wondering why your stocks and crypto took a dive and why prices are going up faster and faster, it's because rising oil prices are directly due to Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Our global economy is weak as long as we're dependent on oil to power our needs. A diversified strategy to satisfy our energy needs would help stop climate change, make our air cleaner, and stop funding strongmen like Putin, who can invade countries on a whim because they have trillions of oil dollars at their disposal to fund their militaries. For more explainers like this video, follow me, David Grasso at Bolt TV. Good luck at the gas pump.